Hello everybody, welcome to game number X. <laughs> no idea which one it is. Up an orc mirror. And he's got block leader mighty. Versus guard guard block sneaky. And he's somehow down 100 TV, I don't understand that. But there you go. They do look pretty bad. I was way better than the official Games Workshop ones. Way better than the official ones. No, oh, he's got. He's got. He was down a reroll and an apple. Oh fuck, there's a guard there instead of there. Oh my god, I didn't even look. Oh, what an idiot. Now he's getting mighty blowed. What an idiot I am. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's so terrible. There should be an extra confirm button when you set up. Like, that's literally what people ask for. Everything they do that's a mistake, they're just like, give us another confirmation screen. Like, God, just fucking pay attention to the game, you dickheads. There was nothing wrong with that, was it? That was just me not paying attention. And then all these fuckheads are like, more confirmation screens. More, more, more. Yeah, of course he's just going to mighty blow him. What a dickhead. Huh? Oh, man, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. <laughs> Control people on Twitch and Discord all day. Do you, Timmy? Oh, thank you very much. I guess you haven't got Elliot to troll anymore, have you? <laughs> right, Fixie does. That's what it's like. It's so, it's so mad, all these people just... Moaning about the fucking everything every time they make a like a mistake with the client Fair enough not a blood bowl mistake, you know like it is frustrating when you make a mistake because like you misclick or whatever rather than you misthink but like That's the fucking game you're playing. Just be better <laughs> Don't don't say make the game absolutely fucking fool like this having a sound to tell you that it's your turn to kick off Absolutely, you should have that because it's so crazy how many times I've just not realised I should be kicking off for like a minute. Because there's just no indication that you should be kicking off. Like that that absolutely should be a thing, right? Like that's that is a problem with the client. But like all the misclicking and then like let give me a hundred confirmations and I don't mess it up again. Oh he dub scold! Oh he powered. Shit. Instant A B break. Okay. And I'm down a guard for like two turns. Fuck me, what an idiot. Great that he's lost half his rerolls though, instantly. Elliot is alive here. He said sounds he was in here earlier anyway. He's, he's, he was in, he's in the stream now. He's in the stream now. He was in uh He was in the fumble chat because I tagged him because I I independently thought of my team, and it was the same that Elliot's playing of the uh, black box trophy. I didn't just copy his team, honest. I independently thought of my own team. I thought it was funny. Now the best thing about it is I can call the I can call the squad Elliot too. It's pretty great, isn't it?
My heat rolled a one. Oh, did he get an extra re-roll? He only had two. Oh, he's got leader. That's why he's got leader. So he did have two re-rolls, but then he's got leader. But still, he's used two re-rolls on turn one. Got two black biggins. I keep calling them black hawks. Two biggins over here. So I probably should keep a decent amount over here. Maybe not, because I've got my troll and his troll's over here. I need to stand him up to stand the troll up. Yeah, yeah, so many games <laughs> against people who use all their rerolls and then never fail anything. Maybe you should just try and get there as soon as possible. And at least you get value from them, like... It is interesting, isn't it? Like, the, the immediate value of something versus the potential future value. It's like, there is a lot to be said for just getting something from it. That was Rick and the Wizard, wasn't it? That, that was the Rick Wizard play all the time. He was a big fan of just getting something out of it. You know, if you use it early, okay, you haven't got the danger of it, but if you just, you know, if you get some value, it's pretty good, isn't it? This is really tough now. That was so shit giving up my guard there. Holy crap. Oh, Blitz is troll. Then if I power it, I get to dodge out my guard. You motherfucking cunt. Kill him. You've only got one rear, I think I'm okay with getting pounded. Way. Oh, Hancock. 
trust you, you filthy minded pervert. Oh, we pushed him back. And this just this big scrap is no good, is it? Is it a picture of your knob dim? I can't play it because it's got it's got sound on it. Okay, phew. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> Thanks, Tim. I did guess what was coming. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks so much, Tim. Hey, dub scold. I can one D the ball. <laughs> I can just fucking one D the ball. No problem. So we've got these two guarders that can come in and do something. And then leave that black orc holding, not black orc, big and It's so easy to say black orc because of obviously the old, they've been black orcs forever, haven't they? Literally double GA fighter one day. I basically have to. How pathetic. Maybe we should have rerolled the one day. If I power him and get a bubble, it's brilliant, isn't it? I didn't mind that I was like, you know, we were having to trade actions. I really didn't mind that. Obviously, him of Mighty Blow, but I mean, he's going to blitz with Mighty Blow, whatever happens. These are quite fast though, right? So it's not terrible. Okay, now they're not fast because he's just fucking troll blitzed.
fuck. I mean, I didn't expect him to troll Blitz, to be fair. Of course he rolls all the dice, as everybody always fucking does. One day somebody won't roll all the dice versus me. But not today. Now a lot of his players are on the wrong side. <laughs> Andre rolled all of the dice to keep the ball safe. But I rolled all of the dice to remove all of his players. <laughs> uh, so the thing is, simply a sensor and uh, pixie dust. Yeah, you do have to take actions. I fully AFK'd versus the AI and got nothing. But people were saying what you can do is you can like play a game versus the AI that would take, say, 40 minutes or whatever. And then just AFK for a couple of hours or whatever, or three or four hours, and then you'll get like three times the XP. Oh, off. <sighs> He's made two removals and I've made none. Fucking bullshit, isn't it? I mean, abs it's absolutely fucking standard. Just every time. Every time. Constant. Not versus Andre, but every other time. Constant every time. <laughs> that one game versus that one game versus Andre, but you know. The two back to back dicings in Aero BB have annoyed me. A lot, to be honest. Which three witches dead in two games? That's fucking ridiculous. Spend all that time building your team, and boom, they're just dead. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Well. Have a sub, you glorious coach. Oh, glorious. Thank you very much. Simply a sense. Ah, oh, yeah. Well, here, this is much better now, isn't it? This is uh, it's an easy 2D on the ball.
Hallo? Fuck off! Are you shitting me? <sighs> Imagine being as diced as Jew. I would never. other like it literally goes to a better person <laughs> it co cost me a reroll it cost me a reroll for him to hand it off from his shit player to his good player <laughs> and i'm the one who paid the reroll for it <laughs> Another AV break, of course. Of course it is. One D pal? Why would it be anything else? And an armor break? Yep. And a removal? Wow, well, completely reasonable play. Completely reasonable player, that. Yep. Yep. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Don't bother failing anything, buddy. I'll fail everything so you don't have to. Whatever you do, don't have one of your players' fucking armor broken. What a fucking nightmare turn that was. Jesus, just getting fucking shit on. Oh, yes, move five, isn't it? Just concede. Comedy mega, isn't it? Absolute fucking comedy mega. I mean, absolute comedy fucking mega. The problem is, I fear he's pretty shit. <laughs> it will cost quite a lot of SR. But, you know, I could also be miserable for a while. Or not miserable for a while.
Jesus Christ. Fucking dubstep. This has not been great. And it's been garbage in fact. It's a mirror where my team is better than his. But I've just been shit on. Three removals to none. And he's a fucking bonus time burn. Fucking bonus time burner. <laughs> what a joke. Stop him. play isn't there what's the betting like it's not 50 50 it's basically guaranteed but hey yeah shocked shocked i tell you shocked hey all right I can stop crying now justice has been served So if I get this KO back, I can maybe beat him one more. Don't get the KO back. I guess I try to score as quick as possible so that can draw one one
Yeah, I it's just score it all for me, right? Like, just do anything I can. I don't need to care about stalling. Just if I can score, I will. Oh, okay, that's pretty good. That's huge, right? Put him down to 10. That is massive. That is actually massive. <laughs> Get off my fucking pitch, prick. <laughs> Ball's pretty safe, so I'm, I'm content to do the troll hit. Good. And the ball wasn't safe, was it, on a dub skull? I should have moved him over. Should have moved him over to there or something. Oh, God. I just needed to move this blitzer to here. It's literally all I needed to do. Okay, good, he didn't power. He re-rolls, because of course he does. Yeah, I can foul him with a goblin, can't I? I can lure him in to foul his... Uh, Foul is mighty blower. Oh fuck you. Maybe I shouldn't have a fucking troll. I'm just so fucking bad at rolling dice. Playing a one D him. Not sure it's worth doing anything else. Just get shit on for a few turns and hope he fucks up. The Elliot, otherwise known as the Elliot Strat. Works a surprising amount of the time, to be honest. Watched so many Elliot games where it looked lost. Yeah, honestly, so many times it looked lost. And like, you know, if you were playing somebody who you thought had, you know, a normal working brain, <laughs> <laughs> you would have tried to do things to make something happen, right? And Elliot just didn't. He just hung in there, played the most conservative moves he could possibly make. <laughs> and then, sure enough, lo and behold, his opponent is a complete moron. Spoons it 
<laughs> totally. And then Elliot gets the ball somehow, stops the score, and wins. Like, it happened so many times. He's going to foul the troll. It's a fucking mega foul as well. Holy shit. It's actually a great foul. But it, it means that uh, he's weak at that side, isn't it? Which is good. Well, you can't help, you can't make yourself be lucky, but you can, you can play like Elliot. Well, I mean, some people can't, but you know what I mean, like the, uh, the Elliot strat. You can follow the Elliot strat. Blitz him to save the dodge off. And then I've got four players over here. Now the guard is in like the safe spot, isn't he? That he can probably isn't tagged and can do something. I mean, you can choose to play like Elliot. You, you, like, you know, what I mean, okay. So if you're not as good as Elliot, you can't play like Elliot. But if you're as good as Elliot, you can choose to adopt his playstyle, right? Like, you can choose to play, like, if you're good, you can choose to play like Inarian, or Chunter, or Eliod. Well, what I was just saying, how he, like, he was playing somebody and he, the game looked over and he just played the safest. The safest players, when the game already looked lost, he would just play the safest plays he could possibly make and then his opponent would somehow mess up and hand him the game. And that happened a lot. Enough to make me think it was the right thing to do versus the average CCLer. It's actually better empowering than pushing me, right? Because it means I can stand up the troll next turn at least. I think you want to start with a Wandy. Is a very sensible move. Oh no, I'm not. I didn't see he hasn't moved him. Shit. Well, that is a bit shit. A one so if I can get a player in there, I can two her. Oh, I could guard in there.
<laughs> Running back. So much for my quick score, eh? <laughs> the patented gym quick score. Going great. <laughs> this is the pretty much standard gym quick score. Right? I'll try and score as soon as possible, and then all of a sudden it's turn four, and I'm deep in my own half. <laughs> It probably will go on my your tube. Yeah. I think it will. I might as well put put these this run on. Like getting nil nil out of this is all right, isn't it? Because it's gone really badly. Oh, he goes down to one reroll. I've got four and he's got one, so that's good, isn't it? There's an advantage. There is an advantage. He's blitzed already, so he's you know it looks like there's a route through to hit the ball, but that actually isn't. The twenty minute one turn, yeah. Yeah, that was great. And this looks pretty good now actually, doesn't it? Bizarrely. Bizarrely this is actually looking pretty decent. I guess it's because he hasn't knocked over literally every single person he's hit this turn. Finally, finally had a turn where not everybody was instantly knocked over. I wonder if I go after his mighty bloat then, eh? Because, like, I've got a lot over here, but he's got two over there, and then my troll's over here and can bang down his troll. Geophile. Or I can just put him in. Fucking twat. Do you see the play, guys? I've got an amazing play here. Okay, it wasn't that amazing. I needed a power for it to really be amazing. It's just a boring, a boring GFI. Do I one day him? I think I have to, but then I guess I might, I might, I might, I might go stupid, and he might go stupid hitting me. Okay. Three turns running out of time. Yeah, really got to get moving. This switched sides turn wasn't such a good idea, was it? Especially as I went so deep by not powering him. Maybe I should have re-rolled the hit on the blitzer to try and get the power. Because without the power, I've just gone backwards and it's 
gone really quite far backwards. If I'd powered him, I could have moved up. Oh, he's rolled up skulls! Yes, he's out of rerolls. Yeah, throwing the gobble is, is, a, is a possibility, to be fair. Not a great possibility, but it is the possibility is there. Also, I can cut back and out the other way, right? Because he's probably going to come as hard as he can over this side. And he doesn't roll a one on his troll. Twat. Mm. Okay, now he's powering everybody. Well, the turn where he didn't power everyone was fucking great, wasn't it? The one turn where he didn't power everybody was a fucking wonderful turn. Do you know what, Tom? I just decided to. Can you believe that? I van potato with the blitzer, yes. I think I'm going to. <laughs> I can believe anything. Yeah. <laughs> right. GFI there. GFI here. He can block him. And then where can he go? Like it's just a three. So I really do want to hit this first. him and where can he go like there come all around here but then where does he go nowhere I guess get into scoring range, I guess I have to, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, so one GFI. I think I might as well make another one as well. Pretty good. Pretty good. Not terrible. Cheeky little potato.
And that puts him in scoring range, like, even that's all right. That freezes thrower. Which isn't all right. But he could just fail this dodge, couldn't he? He could fail the blitzer dodge here. Or the GFI here. No. Rush, so. so he's got a 3 2 to hit the ball, so he could fail a 3 2 and not even hit the ball. Oh, fuck you, you cunt. <sighs> of course, he makes the 3. Of course, he makes the 2. Of course, he rolls double pals. Okay, so it's a GFI here. This isn't bad, blitz him, and then he can go and pick it up and stuff. Fuck me, man. I wonder if I should GFI to be in scoring range, maybe. I've, no, I've already got these two in front. That's a bit shit, isn't it? But I've got two guys in scoring range. And a re-roll. The problem is, everyone can come. So he's going to get... It's probably going to be a nil there, isn't it? It's probably going to be a nil now. But there's a chance, anyway. There's a chance. There is a chance. Everyone can come. You can come and you can come. <laughs> yes, Roger, <Rosa>, yes. <laughs> Oh wow, he didn't get a canoring threat in. That's good, isn't it? That means I can completely commit to being stupid to try and score. Good, good, good. So, 
Do I uphill him? No. I can blitz him. Come here for the assist. He can 1D block him. Then he can dodge. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 handle. That's the play. I remembered the handoff. <laughs> Unbelievable. Whew. Four rerolls, that that extra coaching. Got us the well, brilliant coaching. Got us the win. Flip me. Can't believe it worked. I like the extra, the added, uh, the added. What's it called? Like drama of will it work? Just because it takes so fucking long to click anything in this game. But uh, yeah, pretty good wreck team, but not terrible. He doesn't have a goblin, so no TTM for him. Yeah, <laughs> great design. Adding the suspense, that was it, the suspense. <laughs> the fucking suspense. All right. Four. Four. Yeah, that, that that turn where I like, used, what, two or three rerolls on that turn running away was pretty funny. Like, it is pretty cool that, that you can do these kind of plays, isn't it, with the multiple rerolls. Like, I think it's pretty good. Like, I think that's good. I know people have complained about it. But I quite like the idea. Again, a lot of it is people are used to playing one way for, like, years, aren't they? Yeah, there you go. See, k likes it by now. So like, you know, like that's the thing. People are just used to playing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Right, that's what I was thinking. Like, it's just because people are used to it, right? Like, there's loads of things. There's loads of things that if you just added them now, like, you know, if they weren't around and you added them, people would be like, fuck off, that's stupid, right? Like a blitz event. If it didn't exist, you know, like people like, you know, like, oh, it's essential for the thing. But like, if it didn't exist and somebody said, well, let's add this in, you'd be like, that's fucking mental. If lizard men didn't exist and somebody said, let's, let, you know, cyanide or like, let's add lizard men, you'd be like, that's fucking mental. If somebody said, let's add Amazons, you'd be like, no, let's not add Amazons, thank you very much. So, you know, just because it's the way, like, wild, wildly inaccurate, I mean, wildly inaccurate is a terrible rule. But the wildly inaccurate, if we'd had wildly inaccurate, you know, for years, it would be an amazing day we got rid of it. But... <laughs> <laughs> like some things, like journeymen, right? You couldn't imagine not having journeymen now. Like journeymen were amazing when journeymen came in. So like some things are like obviously amazing when they happen, and some things are obviously terrible. Where I don't think like I don't think the multiple rerolls was obviously either. It was just like I thought it was people not being used to it. You know? Yeah, that's a good rule, Tom. Like glorious victory. How many precious SR did we get? 58, hey, that's pretty good. Like, that's a lot, right? He's, he was only 16, 80. Like, how do you get 50? Like, how do you get twice as much? Like, it's weird, isn't it? It's just fucking weird, I don't know. Like, I was higher than him and got loads. Like, it doesn't work like ELO, right? Like, that's the thing. It's just like, it's massively tilted to go up all the time, which is why Conceding that game against the Chaos and then winning two games, I'm higher than I would if I'd 
finished it, you know, like, so it's just, it's just not worth finishing the games you're losing in terms of time, really, as much as anything. Big and getting five SPP is pretty good, isn't it? This orc lino is just missed next, so I can just sack him. It's quite good having infinite money these days. It's kind of weird how, like, everyone just has infinite money. But that's probably okay as well, just people aren't used to it. No. These back things make no sense, right? Before the back went nowhere else and like just went to the team randomly. And now the back doesn't go back to the team and you've got to press a million places to get to expensive mistakes. Fuck me. <laughs> Block. Good. So two blockers and one, two guarders. This guy needs a touchdown to get mighty blow and then he gets all of the touchdowns after that right um, so, and then we can go there to this oh I could have gone from there I could have gone from this page I could have gone by here but anyway five wins and two concedes is all right isn't it um, there you go thanks for watching everyone don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic